Hey guys, Christo Garcia, my swing evolution. Oh my gosh. I've spent the last week at the PGA show and it was one of the most thrilling events of my life. I got to meet so many wonderful people and I've got a ton of awesome videos that are gonna be coming out in the next week or so. And my gosh, I was supposed to play golf with my brother Don today, but it is a cold, cold rainy day here in Florida. So I am just gonna be working on my computer. But my video that I'm gonna put out today is a heartwarming story about a young golfer named Brady. And uh, this story was brought to me by my friend Michael Sestone, who runs the, the Sestone Golf Academy at West Chase down here in Tampa. And uh, I just thought it'd be a great way to get myself back into making videos and sharing these great golf stories before I get back to LA and start busting my butt on the range again and working on my golf game. So if you like this content, please subscribe, hit a like and leave a comment because we have a great environment and community for My Swing Evolution, full of great golfers with big hearts. And I hope you like today's video. Hit them long and hit them straight. So my name is Brady and I like to golf. My son Brady is a golfer here at West Chase under the Sestone Academy in uh, Tampa, Florida. And uh, we've been coming here for about six years now. He uh, started at first tee as a toddler. And uh, ever since then, he just picked up the club and started swinging and, and seemed to love the sport. Yeah, it's his passion. So Brady was, uh, he was looking for a new putter. Putters can be very expensive. And you know, Brady, you know, likes the Scotty Cameron putters. Brady's always asking for the latest technology to uh, get any competitive advantage he can on the course. And they basically was at uh, the realization that he needed a new putter. I was golfing on the putting green, practicing my putting with my old putter. And a guy named Eddie came up to me and he's like, I heard you're looking for a new putter. Brady was telling me a story about uh, how he was gonna take all his money and he was gonna try to buy an expensive putter. And I said to him, Brady, I'll tell you what, I've got lots of putters, lots of real good putters. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll sell you a putter that's worth a lot more than you're gonna pay for it. And the only thing you have to do in return is do a good deed for others. The conditions were basically, Eddie was making sure that Brady would spend time down at the Metropolitan Ministries donating his time. He needed to have it documented. He needed to uh, have uh, Brady going down there at least once or twice. Those were really the things that Eddie wanted from this specific um, initiative. And then basically, once those things were accomplished, Brady would be allowed to utilize the putter and, um, and, and keep the putter for his as he moved forward and, and progressed in golf. And I think that's really nice because I have everything I need and more. And I think it's good that they get some stuff that they need too, the essentials they need to live. To follow through on the story, we, um, we all went down there on a, on a Friday afternoon. Um, Brady decided to take $100 of his own money that he saved up throughout the year and give it to the kids in need at the Metropolitan Ministries. And so he and his family have started feeding the homeless and helping those less fortunate. And they're just paying it forward, which is a wonderful thing. So let's cut to the chase. Here's my old golf swing. And here's my new golf swing. Five years ago, I started a YouTube channel and I wanted to improve my golf swing by using Ben Hogan's five lessons. Well, guess what? It worked. And along the way, I picked up over 8 million views on YouTube 
and I learned how to shoot under par. Unbelievable, right? Well, the great news is I have a brand new instructional video called The Hogan Code. In this video, I break down everything that I learned over my long journey to learn to swing like Ben Hogan. And now you can learn the very same techniques that I use to become the golfer I always wanted to be.